It's tea time. Do you know what bubble tea is? Well, anyone who's ever been to Taiwan for sure does. It's also known as pearl milk tea, boba milk tea, tapioca tea, boba nai cha, zhenzhu nai cha, QQ, or any other combination. The fun of bubble milk tea comes from the small chewy tapioca balls, also known as the pearls, boba or zhenzhu. The drink is made in a variety of different ways and has many flavors, but the most popular and original is the Taiwanese bubble milk tea. If you look around in the street, you will notice dozens of tea places offering a variety of drinks. One of the most popular is, of course, Zhenzhu Nai Cha. Zhenzhu is a Chinese word for pearls, and Nai Cha means milk tea. Every day, a lot of people come to tea places to order their favorite drinks. They drink thousands of plastic glasses of bubble milk tea. I like bubble tea. I love it. First, I really like uh, the milk tea, and um, I really like the tapioca because it can let me uh, feel relaxed <laughs> because I need to chew it. And when I have some problems and pro um, and and when I need to do some annoying things. I need to buy a, a, a cup of bubble tea and then drink it and chew it. Bubble tea is the most incredible thing that I met in Taiwan. And now I also bought one for myself. You gotta shake it first. And then you unwrap the straw. And the most magic move is to actually put the straw into the glass. Success. Many foreigners don't like bubble tea, but I liked it like the first time I tried it. Obviously, I'm not the one obsessed with this drink. Meet Taj, the exchange student from the US. Just like me, he is always up for a cup of chewy and delicious bubble tea. Oh, I got that in on the first try. <laughs> Bubble tea. Sure, Mom. Yeah, and taste it. I love bubble tea. <laughs> bubble tea is my favorite Taiwanese drink here. It's actually like the first time I tried it, this specific kind of bubble tea was actually here in Taiwan. I tried another type back in the States, but it's different. It doesn't have the tapioca bubbles in them. So here's the first time I tried the authentic Taiwanese bubble tea, and it's my favorite drink here so far. The most amazing thing here is that you can actually choose your sugar level and uh, ice, ice level. For the sugar, you can either choose no sugar uh, or choose 30% uh, sugar, then 50%, then 70%, and 90%. And full sugar. It's like the standard, but in, in fact for some people it's too sweet. I personally prefer half, half sugar. For the ice, you can also choose like uh, less ice, uh, half ice, then a little bit of ice and no ice. Mostly I take uh, half sugar and no ice. But when it's too hot, I prefer a little bit of ice, so the drink will stay cold for at least 15 minutes longer. But tastes differ and everyone can decide what sugar level and what ice level they like. Um, I like uh, less sugar and less ice one, because the regular one is too sweet. Uh, half sugar and no ice. Mm. 
nowadays we 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 focus on the healthy life so maybe we choose the less sugar one i always get no ice because i don't want it to ruin the sweetness and then i always get it depends on the size <laughs> so if i get a medium i'll get 70 percent and then if it's a uh, large i'll get 90 percent but sometimes i'll get 70 percent for a large and 50 percent for a medium depending on how i feel with 90% sugar. The most important uh, ingredient, the bubbles themselves, are also different. They can be big, large bubbles, or small bubbles. Big bubbles are always called zhenzhu, da zhenzhu, or boba. And small bubbles are just zhenzhu. Today I took big bubbles. I like them most of all because they're very chewy and very cool. You just drink it and then chew it because small bubbles are just there in your mouth and you cannot chew them. I like the boba one, the big one, not the small one. <laughs> if I add a small one, I cannot chew it. <laughs> just drink it and throw it into... Yeah, so I like the bubble, the big one. For the milk in the drink, um, most of the tea shops use uh, milk powder. So if you just come and order Zhenzhou Nai Cha in like a big, big tea places or chain stores, they will uh, make your drink using the milk powder. But you can also specifically ask for Zhenzhou Xian Nai Cha, and it uh, they will add the fresh milk into your drink. Oh, Here in Taiwan, I'm so obsessed with bubble tea, so I drink it almost every day. And now when I will have to go back soon, uh, I try to drink it as often as I can. So this is my cup for today and I'm very glad to have it. I probably drink bubble tea every other day. <laughs> I have drinking it twice a day, uh, but they were both medium cups. So <laughs> it wasn't that, that bad. How often do I drink it? Oh. It is up to my soul, <laughs> but actually, um, once a week, once a week, yes. I used to drink three days a week, but now I think it's not not good for me, so I drink one one times a week. Make bubble tea? Let me think. Yeah, I know how to make bubble tea. Not at all. Not in the slightest. I mean, I know it's like milk tea, so you gotta get the milk and the tea, right? You put it together, and then <laughs> the tapioca bubbles uh, I've heard have been made from like sugar. I don't, I don't know how they're made. I don't know. I don't know. Actually, tapioca balls are made from the starch extracted from a tropical plant called cassava root. You have to boil them, then rinse in the cold water and add sugar. That's when they get their sweetness and chewiness. When we want to make a bubble milk tea, we put the ice in the shake, shake, and you add the tea and the coffee, coffee milk or the milk together, and you put uh, pour them into a bottle and you add some bubble inside then the bubble milk tea is okay to try the best bubble tea we went to chong shui tang the chong shui tang tea house claims to be the original inventor of the bubble tea the founder of the tea house observed how the japanese served cold coffee and applied this method to tea the actual creator of the bubble tea is the tea house's product development manager who poured tapioca balls into the iced tea drink during a meeting in 1988. The beverage was well received by the people at the meeting, leading to its inclusion on the menu. 
It ultimately became the franchise's top-selling product. We are now waiting for our bubble tea. It's really large and I'm really excited. I like it. Because it because it's it's like they're larger than the small ones that the Sherlock has. I I'm glad that we ordered like eighty percent sugar because this, yeah. if this was fifty percent, I would not have this put it all. This is just acceptable. So we just got our this is a large cup and this is a small cup. Just right. Yeah, we call it these are just right, but they're generally a bit small. Like, for me, they're a bit small, but the sugar level is just right, and it has like a kind of, how do you call it, the foam on top. Yeah. I don't know what that is. The other two places don't have that, and they only have the Xian Nai here, like an apple one. They don't use the milk over here. That's and why they have that. That must be too big. Okay. Bubble tea is one of the most significant and surprising things for me here in Taiwan. I think in the future, whenever I encounter like bubble tea place or bubble tea itself, I will immediately be reminded of my experience in Taiwan because I think that bubble tea here is the most delicious and the coolest drink in the world. Um, definitely because it's a Taiwanese drink, they made it, it's their own, so I think it definitely does represent it. However, throughout the rest of the world, I don't think a lot of people know that because I had no idea bubble tea was Taiwanese, like not in the slightest, I, until I came here and they're like, yeah, this is the country of origin. Like, that's so cool. But I think they should put like a little made in Taiwan on like every bubble tea everywhere in the world and then then it'll represent Taiwan better. And, uh, many foreigners come to Taiwan uh, it, they must to drink and taste it. It's a really delicious drink in Taiwan. Yeah. So. Come drink bubble tea. Lai Taiwan Hu Nai Cha Ba Drink bubble teas, 来喝珍珠奶茶吧。